mushinga wo kubaka inzu zikiriritse ngira ngo murabizi neza yuko mu Rwanda uko abaturage bakomeza kwiyongera ni nako nubundi akenerwa ahantu ho kuba cyangwa ho gutura yaba abantu ku giti cyabo cyangwa se n'imiryango muri rusange ibyo rero byanze bikunze bigomba gukemuka ariko hari abagize uruhare mu kubaka izi nzu niyo mpamvu rero mushinga bwiza Riverside Homes urwaje kugira ngo mu byukuri ugire iki kemura mu bijyanye no kugira ngo abantu babone aho batura inzu rero zigiye gutangizwa ku mugaragaro kubakwa uyu munsi no mushinga mu byukuri umaze igihe waratekerejwe kuko mu kwezi kwa 11 mu mwaka wa 2022 nibwo hasinywe amasezerano yo kubaka izi nzu ni nzu rero zigiye gutangira muri uyu mwaka zikazaba zuzuye ari 1500 nebyiri byumikana yuko imiryango cyangwa yego imiryango 1500 nibiri bashobora kubona aho batura muri uyu mwaka icyo rero ariko nanone ntago bivuze yuko arizo zonyine kubera ko no mu gihe gikurikiye kubera ko ni byiciro bitanu izi nzu zigomba kuba zubatwemo zikazarangira nibura habonetse inzu ihumbi bibiri na magane ni inzu rero nyinshi mu byukuri zikenewe zije gukemura ikibazo cyo kugira ngo abantu bagiye babona aho batura bitabagoye icyo nababwira rero nuko muri iyi minsi cyangwa se muri iki gihe uko abantu bagenda biyongera uko abantu bagenda bakena aho gutura ni nako hagiye ntaboneka inzu zikiriritse ngira ngo iyo turebye mu mibare turasanga ko izi nzu nibura abantu bafishwa kuba bafite amafaranga agera kuri miliyoni 16000 nibihumbi 1500 muri uyu mudugudu cyangwa se muri iki cyanya ashobora kuhabona inzu yabamo ifite ibyumba bibiri n'uruganiro byumvikana rero yuko umugizi inzu zizaba zuzuye zizakemura byinshi zizatuma abantu babona aho kuba ku buryo butandukanye cyane cyane ko ari n'inzu nubundi zegere ikigari bivuze yuko abantu bari hafi bakora mu mugi wa Kigali ni birometero mi gusa uh, kugera hano muri uyu mudugudu cyangwa se muri iki cyanya ikarama bivuze yuko igihe uh, abantu bazaba bashoboye kubona aho kuba nta nubwo bizajya binabagora no kubona uh, uko bagenda kwera ko na hantu hegere umuhanda hari kaburimbo birumvikana yuko nubundi byanze bikunze bazaba basubijwe navuga uh, kabiri uh, rero dufite uh, video reka twumve uko abayobozi uh, bamwe babisobanura bareba mu byukuri cyangwa basobanura uko uh, kubaka izi nzu cyakamaro bizagira cyane cyane mu kugera ku ntego u Rwanda rwihaye zo kujyo kugera ku bantu cyangwa se kushakisha uko abantu bagenda batura cyane cyane bijyanye n'amategeko kandi none no kuburyo burambye reka twumve uko abayobozi babisobanura According to the OECD Better Life Index Rwandans value home ownership as the number one factor of happiness Home ownership has a major societal impact as it empowers individuals with a sense of safety, confidence, patriotism and dignity. At the national level, it creates value from within through the generation of assets and the reduction of financial insecurity. Currently, the housing shortage in Kigali is estimated at 344,000 new units over the next 10 years. This shortage is driven by a growing population that is rapidly urbanizing and faces insufficient housing options. Affordable housing is uh, one of the priority sectors that has been particularly identified in our investment code, which means that um, it is one of those sectors that will drive the vision that we have for our country. Specifically for um, affordable housing, the government has a goal for urbanization to reach 35% in the country. That means that we need to see more housing uh, being built to accommodate this urbanization process. We, we simply need to, to see how we can, you know, optimize the use of, of our piece of land in a way that we observe the urbanization, uh, you know, uh, techniques, but in the decent uh, living conditions for our people. The vision is just to contribute uh, to allow every citizen to have a decent home at affordable price. Uh, when we call investors to come and bring their investment for in affordable housing projects, we really need to set up a strong incentive schemes to attract them. Our, our prime mission is to sort of like provide affordable and dignifying homes to the population at large. And we can only do that when we go into partnership with the public sector. And that's where we actually benefit all the incentive that the government has actually put in place 
for any potential developers like ourselves. With this construction permit, occupancy permit, land title, all those processes that happen in institutions that we work very closely with, uh, the Rwanda Development Board facilitates investors so that they can get all these permits quickly and be able to go to do what we want them to do, which is to uh, build houses. So we target all the aspects like a 360 support, activating demand, providing financing for developers, and giving them a grant, which is the infrastructure subsidy on behalf of government, to reduce their cost of construction. And it's thinking about housing at the scale of the neighborhood rather than the individual house is a game changer, especially as it relates to urbanization. So it's been really, um, uh, for all different players in the housing uh, sector, it's been really quite transformative to have these policies and the support of the government. They're not going to be able to, to, to have significant supply or to be able to narrow that gap if we are still building in the old conventional style. So accepting uh, the, the role of technology is extremely important in terms of scaling up the supply of uh, affordable housing units. And the solution can only be found in, uh, in putting up this kind of project uh, in affordable housing. Komeje gukurikirana ibiganiro bya televiziyo y'u Rwanda kwakomeje kwibabwira kare yuko hagiye gutangira igikorwa cyo kubaka amazu aciriritse hano ikarama mu murenge wa Kigali mu karere ka Nyarugenge n'umuhango rero nubundi nkuko mubona witabiriwe n'abayobozi bakuru b'igihugu ubu rero mu mwanya abayobozi bakuru b'igihugu araba bahageze nkuko mubona president wa Republika Paul Kagame ageze hano ndetse na madam Jeanette Kagame bakaba bari mu bakaba abayobozi bakuru bagiye kwitabira iki gikorwa mu byukuri cyo gutangiza iyubakwa rya ya mazu aciriritse mu byukuri rero twagira ngo mu mwanya tuze kuba tureba uko aya mazu ateye uko ameze ndetse n'uburyo azafasha abazayaturamo na mazu rero ari mu nzego navuga esheshatu aho mu minsi iri imbere aba mbere bazaba batangiye kuyajyamo no kuvuga yuko rero mu mwanya mutoya abayobozi bakuru baraza kuba basura batambagizwa aya mazu kugira ngo bare mu byukuri uko ameze cyane ko nubundi nkuko komeje kwibabwira na mazu yubatse mu buryo bugezweho amazu arondereza ubutaka akoreshejwe ibikoresho navuga bidahenze cyane ni byuma ntabwo mu byukuri yihanganira umuyaga bivuze yuko kuba yatwarwa n'umuyaga cyangwa se kuba hari ikindi cyayageraho ingaruka mu byukuri ntago bishoboka bayobozi rero bakuru b'igihugu bagiye gutambagira aya mazu bareba uko ateye bareba uko yubatse ndetse n'ibikoresho yubatse ndetse n'ubukomere bwayo ni igikorwa mu byukuri gikomeye mu mwanya rero turaza kuba tunareba tunatambagira niko navuga biciye mu video mu riza video kugira ngo ture mu byukuri uko aya mazu azaza ba ameze twabibutsa yuko ari umushinga mu byukuri w'igihe kirekire aho mu kiciro cya mbere uyu mwaka ari bwo hazuba kwa mazu magana biri na mirongo itanu na abiri na mazu mu byukuri menshi ariko nanone umushinga mugari uzubakwa mo amazu ibihumbi bibiri na magana ane ni umushinga mu byukuri uzubakwa cyangwa amazu azubakwa mu byiciro bitanu ba engineer cyangwa rero abagize umushinga ugiye uh, kubaka amazu barimo gusobanurira umukuru w'igihugu uko ya amazu ateye reka mu byukuri turebe uko mu buryo bwa video uh, uko aya amazu ateye ese aya amazu ameza ate mu byukuri mu buryo uh, burambuye reka dukurikirane video umushinga wa bwiza river site indi ntambwe mu miturire igezweho muri Kigali Urugendo rwo gutangiza ibikorwa byo kubaka umudugudu wa Bwiza River Site rwatangiriye mu biganiro guverinoma y'u Rwanda n'abashora mari bibumbiye muri societe yitwa ADHI kugira ngo igihugu gikomeze gukemura ikibazo cy'inzu zihendutse zikiri nkeye Iyi societe ADHI izwe ubu nararibonye mu guhanga udushya mu rwego rw'ubwubatsi burondereza ubutaka n'ibikoresho 
no kuzuza ku gihe umubare w'inzu zose yemeye kubaka no kuzishyikiriza abafatanya bikorwa bayo kandi sujuje ibyangombwa byose bitanga ikizere cyo kuramba kwazo ni kubwiyo mpamvu mu kwezi kugushyingo mu mwaka 2022 societe ADHI yagiranye amasezerano na guverinoma y'u Rwanda y'umushinga w'ubwubatsi bw'inzu zihendutse wiswe bwiza riva site umushinga wa bwiza riva site uzashyirwa mu bikorwa mu byiciro bitanu bivuze ko bizafata imyaka myinshi aho ikiciro cy'ambere kizarangira muri uyu mwaka 2022 kikazaba kigizwe n'inzu zose hamwe 254 mu gihe umushinga wose uzarangira hubatswe inzu 2024 Mu misozi ya Karama mu karere ka Nyarugenge mu birometero 10 uvuye rwagati mu mujyi wa Kigali ni hwizinzu zigiye kubakwa. Sinzu zo gutura mu gusa zizubakwa muri uyu mushinga wa Bwiza Riverside kuko hateganyijwe ibindi bikorwa birimo irerero ryita kubana bato ahazashyirwa ubiko bw'ibintu bitandukanye ishuri ry'imyuga n'ubumenyi ngiro ibiro ndetse nibindi. Muri imyubakiri ijyanye n’igihe hateganyije ubwoko butandatu bw’inzu bunyuranye mu buryo yikeneye yahitamo ihuje n’ubushobozi n’amahitamo ye cyangwa bitewe n’umubare w’abakeneye kuyibamo. Inzu ya mbere izaba ifite metero kare mirongo ine ifite ibyumba bibiri byo kuraramo ubwogero igikoni na parikingi y’imodoka. Iyi nzu kandi izabigeretse inshuro imwe ku buryo igice cyo hejuru nacyo giteganyijwe kugira abagituramo. Iyi nzu izaba ifite agaciro ka miliyoni 1.65 by'amafaranga y'u Rwanda. Inzu yindi ifite ibyumba bibiri ubwogero, igikoni, ubusitani, parikingi y'imodoka kandi ikanagira ubuso bungana na metero kare 365 ikazagurwa miliyoni 28 z'amanyarwanda. Inzu ya gatatu yo ifite ibyumba bitatu byo kuryamamo uruganiriro ni gikoni aho guparika ubuso bwayo bukaba bwisumbuyeho kuko izaba iteretse ahantu ahangana na metero kare 70 kandi ikaba ihagaze ku gaciro ka miliyoni 32 za amafaranga y'u Rwanda Umwihariko w'inzu ya kane nuko ubuso bwayo noneho ari metero kare 90 ibyumba bitatu igikoni uruganiriro ubwogero na parikingi yo izagurwa miliyoni 35.5 z'amafaranga y'u Rwanda Na inzu ya gatanu sibye kuba yujuje nk'ibyinzu ya kane yanahawe akazi na kakabyiniriro ka Sofia ikagira metero kare 90 inafite ubusitani bwisanzuye ufite miliyoni 48 azabashobora kwiturira muri iyi nzu Mujibu kwa kubinzu ya gata nda tu izuwa kwa umushinga wabgiza Liverside, yisiko muringa, yo ikabifitu mngi hariko, wakujiribu jumba bine, chokurija mamo, ikikoni, uruga niriro, ibaraza, ubusitani, letena parichi njiza achira, imodo kazirenzi mge, ikaba ibereye umurijango mugari ujizgue na banu benshi, kuri milioni minungu nani neshe shatu, Na cha kubuza gutura muri yinzu izaba iteretse kuri metero kare ijana na minungu tatuneshanu. Ugiza liva site urugerogwa mahitamo yimiturire ijezgo homo muji wa chigari aho sosiete ADHI itiba jiwe no gutegura kure njeri vidu chichije haba mwuzi mbele ndeteno mwusitani. Amashanyarazi yateganyijwe gukoreshwa mu nzu zo muri bwiza Riverside agomba kuba aziga mu muriro ku gipimo cya 53 ku ijana hateganyijwe ko amatara yo kumihanda agomba kuba afatiye ku mirasire yizuba ishuri ry'ubumenyi ngiro rizuba kwa muri uyu mushinga ryitezwe ko nibura rizahumenye abagera ku rundi bitandatu 2005 Kugira ngo ubone inzu mu bwiza Riverside bizajya bigusaba kujya ku rubuga rw'abanye amajyambere y'u Rwanda BRD ari rwo iwanje akadomo BRD akadomo rwa Kugira ngo rero wiyandikishe mu bakeneye inzu iyi nzu ikazajya yishyurwa mu myaka 20 kunyungu ya 11 kwijana 
Giza Riverside ije gutanga umusanzu wayo mu gufasha Rwanda kugera ku ntego zarwo zo kuba mu mwaka 2033 hazaba hubatswe inzu ibihumbi mirongo ine aho muri zo izigera kuri mirongo irindwi ku ijana zizaba ziciriritse Buildings are key to a sustainable future because their design, construction, and operation are significant contributors to the challenges linked to climate change. According to the World Green Building Council, the construction and operations of buildings consume 36% of energy globally and are responsible for 39% of energy-related CO2 emissions. With rapid urbanization and growing world population, the construction sector must face this explosion in demand with 230 billion square meters by 2060, which amounts to building the equivalent of New York City every month during the next 40 years. If we Girango nkuko mwakomeje kubikurikirana bakurikiye televiziyo y'u Rwanda girango murabona yuko umukuru w'igihugu ari mu gusura izinzu zubatswe n'inzu mu byukuri ninzu mu byukuri zubatswe kugira ngo zikemure cyangwa zitange umusanzu mu gukemura ikibazo cy'amacumbi yaba hirya no hino mu gihe ariko cyane cyane mu mujyi wa Kigali kuko murabizi yuko ari mu gihe tuwe nabantu benshi ubwo rero uko abantu bagenda biyongera ndavuga mu bwinshi bw'abaturage ni namaboko y'igihugu ariko nanone baba bagomba gukenera ahantu ho kuba habahesheje agaciro izi nzu rero nkuko nakomeje kubibabwira ni nzu mu byukuri zubakishijwe n'ibyuma bivuze yuko zitaremereye hamwe tuba tuvuga gusenyuka vuba cyangwa se na bwa bukonje bujya bwibasira inzu ntabwo izi nzu zubatswe mu byo gukorana buhanga ku buryo kuba zakonja kwa kunizi turuka hasi mu mafondasiyo ntago bishoboka kubera ko zubakishije ibyuma ni inzu rero nanone ubu ngubu abazikenera bazazikenera mu minsi imbere nkuko nabibabwiraga bizajya bisaba yuko biyandikisha biciye muri berde cyangwa muri banki y'igihugu y'amajyambere ni banki mu byukuri isanzwe ifasha abantu mu mishinga itandukanye yaba imishinga yo bwubatsi ndetse imishinga y'ibikorwa remezo bitandukanye kugeza abaturage ku ngo amashanyarazi ibyo byose berde ikunze kuba itere inkunga iyo mishinga aha rero tunabibutsa yuko kugira ngo iyi nzu uyibone nuko nabivugaga no kugira ngo ube wa kwa applying cyangwa se wakuyanisha kugira ngo uje ku rutonde rw'abakeneye inzu nababwiraga yuko mu minsi iri imbere mu gihe inzu zizaba zubatswe mu minsi iri imbere nibura inzu ibihumbi 2400 nizo zizaba zubatswe mu byiciro bitanu uyu mwaka uzarangira hubatswe inzu 2500 birazwi cyangwa nkuko biri gutangazwa n'ubuyobozi bwa bwi company DHI irimo kubaka inzu inzu birumvikana ku fatanye na guverinoma y'u Rwanda a uh, umuntu uzajya ukenera kusaba inzu azajya nayishyura mu gihe nibura cy'imyaka 20 ayishyura ku nyungu ya 11 ku ijana na amafaranga mu byukuri uh, atari menshi kuko uh, ntekereza yuko bizaca mu mishahara ya bitewe uh, naho umuntu azabakora cyangwa ne umushahara azaba yinjiza ibyo byose bikazagenwa na berde kugira ngo uh, toranywe abagomba guhabwa izi nzu ariko kana bagaragaje ubushake ubwo rero byumvikana yuko uyu ni umusanzu ukomeye ni umusanzu ukomeye wabafatanya bikorwa mu byukuri barimo gufatanya n'u Rwanda kugira ngo bagire uko batanga umusanzu wabo ejo nejo bundi kibazo cy'amacumbi cyane cyane akiriritse nacyo kigende gikemuka kuko ubushobozi bw'abantu ntago buba bungana bivuze rero yuko mu minsi iri imbere bitewe n'amafaranga umuntu ashobora kubabona ashobora kuzabona inzu ye imubereye bitewe no na mafaranga afite na ubwo rero nababwiraga yuko mu mwanya yuko inzu ubu ngubu ya makesho akufite ibyumba bibiri nibura ndetse n'uruganiriro n'igikoni 
nubwo gero ibyo byose ku mafaranga miliyoni 16 n'ibihumbi 1500 umuntu abashobora kuba yabona inzu y'ibyumba bibiri nkuko na yimaze kubabwira ariko bivuje n'umuntu ni byangu ngwa byose byo munzu birimo ibikoni n'imindi ubwo rero biruna numvikana yuko mu minsi iri imbere abadafite inzu zo guturamo ubashobora kuba ubungu bari mu kugenda basubizwa kandi ngira ngo uko tugena tubona iterambere ry'igihugu fata indi ntera ni nako nabafatanya bikorwa muri uru rwego rw'ubwubatsi nabo bagenda abiyongera ngira ngo muzi uduce twinshi tw'igihugu cyane cyane mu mujyi wa Kigali twagiye dutoranywa kugira ngo tuzubakwemo inzu ziciriritse aha tuvuga nka hano birumvikana karama mu murenge wa Kigali hari rugarama mu murenge wa Nyamirambo hari za kinyinya hari indera aho hose ndetse nahandi nta ze ntekereza yuko umunsi iyi mishinga yashyizwe mu bikorwa ku buryo bwuzuye nayo izagenda ifasha abantu cyane ko nubundi mu myaka 10 iri imbere nibura urwanda ruzaba rukeneye inzu zigera mu bihumbi 330 ibyo rero birasaba yuko abafatanya bikorwa batandukanye bagira uruhare nkuko nubundi barimo kubigaragaza kugira ngo bafatanye na government mu Rwanda kugera kuri iyi ntego yo guha cyangwa yo gushakira abaturage aho bagomba kuba kuko nubundi ni inshingano zo gufashanya kugira ngo umuturage nawe abashe kubaho neza abashe kubona inzu imubereye inzu imubereye imuhesha agaciro ubwo rero umukuru w'igihugu ndetse na madamu wa Janet Kagame barimo barasura bafatanyije n'abayobozi batandukanye kugira ngo barebe mu byukuri izinzu uko zubatse ibyo zizafasha abaturage mu minsi iri imbere zizaba zuzuye ikindi nabibutsa nuko izinzu ziwakwa vuba cyane kwera ko nubundi ntago zikenera matafari nkuko tubimenyereye cyangwa se n'imindi bikoresho byo bwo bihambaye ahubwo no gufunga na ibyuma na ma vise cyangwa amaburo kugira ngo inzu yuzure kandi vuba abahanga bavaga yuko mu kwezi kumwe inzu iba ibonetse ubwo rero twizera yuko wenda mu gihe kitarambiranye nkuko n'umuntu byagaragajwe hazaba hamaze kuboneka inzu za mbere izi zihari ubungu buni zo kwerekana mu byuka yuko n'umuntu ziruzuye bivuze yuko n'ubundi mu mese imbere banyirazo bashobora kuba bamaze kuzigura nababwiraga rero kubijyanye nibiciro aho nababwiraga ko inzu yamakeya ishobora kuboneka ku mafaranga miliyoni 10 n'esheshuro nibihumbi 5000 byumvikana yuko hari nizindi hari inzu nubundi ko zigenda zirutanwa mu byumba cyangwa se na za parking kuko byose byarateganijwe ibyo byose ani bichiro bigenda abirutana harimo iminzu ya miliyoni 33 miliyoni 35 miliyoni 46 ndetse na miliyoni 83 ibyo rero nubundi biva cyangwa se guhitamo nuko aburi wese bitewe n'icyo ashobora kubona ku mushahara we cyangwa se amafaranga ashobora kwinjiza mu gihe runaka kugira ngo azajya abasha kwishyura y'inzu ya zaba yahawe mu gihe kiri imbere rero birumvikana yuko mu minsi bere bamwe mu bakeneye inzu byajyaga bigora bazaba babasha kuzibona kandi bakazishyura mu gihe kirekire cyane ko binagora benshi kubona amafaranga icyarimwe iyo kugura ikibanza yo kubaka inzu kuzura ikarangira umuntu akayibamo iki rero navuga yuko ari intambwe yindi igihugu giteye mu rwego rw'ubwubatsi mu rwego rwo gushakira abaturage ahantu ho gutura ahantu ho kuba kandi nanone hujuje ubuziranenge mu mwanya basobanuraga yuko izi nzu nubundi ni nzu zizaba zinakoresha amashanyarazi navuga gabanutse cyangwa azigamwa aho nubundi no kurengera bidukikije nabyo byatekerejweho kubera ko hazaba hateye ibiti bya bizana umuyaga ariko nanone 
hazaba hari n'amashanyarazi ku muhanda cyangwa hagati y'izinzu amashanyarazi azaba afatiye ku minasire y'izuba ubwo rero urumva yuko kubera ubwinshi bw'inzu zizaba zihari aya amashanyarazi nayo ari mu rwego rwo kurengera ibidukikije kandi nanone kuba harimo ni korana buhanga rishobora kuzajya ryingiza umwuka muri izinzu nabyo twavuga ko ari ikindi kintu gikomeye bivuze yuko uko abantu bagenda batera intambwe mu birebana no ubwubatsi ikorana buhanga technology byanze bikunze hari nibindi bizagerwaho bisumba ibi ngibi turakomeza rero tubabwira yuko ari mu muhango turimo ubu ngubu wo kutaha cyangwa gutangiza ku mugaragaro iyi bakwa ry'inzu ziciriritse hano mu karere ka Nyarugenge byumwe hari ko mu murenge wa Kigali ahazwe nka Karama cyangwa se nabakunze kuhita Norvège byumvikana rero uko no kuhita iryo zinu bwabyo no kwerekana iterambere hagenda hagira kuva mu myaka mikeya ishize usibye kuba hari no muhanda wa Kaburimbo ubatswe ndetse hari ni zindi nzu nanone zubakiwe abaturage kugira ngo bave mu manege kabaze bature ahantu heza habafasha icyo twakwibutsa none icyo twakwibutsa nanone nuko mu minsi iri imbere aha hantu ikarama nubundi hagiye kubakwa ikigo navuga ishuri ryo ryo bumenyi ngiro ku buryo nubundi abo bazaba bubaka izinzu nubundi abenshi bazaba ari aba bamaze kwiga mu muri iri shuri noneho bakanabona akazi ko kubaka izinzu ngira ngo nayo yabwiye uko akenewe cyangwa uyu mushingo uzarangira hubatswe inzu ibihumbi bibiri na magana ne ni inzu rero nyinshi byumvikana yuko hazaba habonekamo n'imirimo ku buryo navuga buhora bwo kubaka izi nzu cyane ko n'imibari igaragaza yo yuko nibura abantu bagera ku bihumbi bitandatu na magana bibiri na mirongo itanu bazaba babasha kurangiza amasomo yabo hano y'imyuga n'ubumenyi ngiro iyo rero nayo ni ndi nyungu kubera ko bazaba fite ubumenyi buhagije bushobora gufasha kubaka izinzu birumvikana ariko bashobora no gufasha nahandi babona akazi haba hano mu Rwanda ndetse no ku rwego mpuza mahanga nanone kuba hazajya irerero cyangwa se ahantu hashobora gufasha abana batoya nabyo ni ndi ntambwe izabikomeye kubera ko inzu zingana gutyo imiryango izabituyemo izabifite abana birasaba rero uko hagomba kuba haratekerejwe ko aba bana nabo bagomba gukomeza kwitabgaho kugira ngo ubuzima bwabo igihe ababyeyi babo bagiye mu kazi ukomeze nta mwana ugize ikibazo bitabwe reka rero dukomeze dukurikirane mu buryo bw'amashusho uko izinzu zimeze ndetse nuko ku rwego mpuza mahanga cyane cyane aho bagiye bakora ubu bwubatsi nabo cyo nakwerekana nuko cyangwa nasobanura nuko byanze bikunze byagiye bitanga umusaruro haba mu bihugu bya Afrika nese no mu bihugu bya kure reka dukurikirane iyi video Buildings are key to a sustainable future because their design, construction, and operation are significant contributors to the challenges linked to climate change. According to the World Green Building Council, the construction and operations of buildings consume 36% of energy globally and are responsible for 39% of energy-related CO2 emissions. With rapid urbanization and growing world population, the construction sector must face this explosion in demand with 230 billion square meters by 2060, which amounts to building the equivalent of New York City every month during the next 40 years. If we are going to save our planet, it is absolutely crucial that we make the right choices now, as a huge part of the solution lies in those future buildings. To make the right choices, we first need to understand how the construction sector carries such a heavy carbon footprint. First, it's through the embodied carbon, and second, through the operations of building, to be rephrased. In the building industry, embodied carbon refers to the greenhouse gas emissions arising from the manufacturing, transportation, installation, maintenance, and disposal of building materials. In contrast, operational carbon refers to the greenhouse gas emissions due to building energy consumption. The figures can be quite alarming. 
Construction accounts for 30% of global extraction of natural resources and 25% of solid waste. Climate change considerations have been paramount in ADHI's evolution and the reduction of our building's carbon footprint has been at the center of its missions. ADHI's construction process and its selection of materials minimize emissions and waste while maximizing recycling and reuse. EDGE, an innovation of the International Finance Corporation, is a tool and certification system that helps developers and construction professionals to deliver greener buildings. Compared with a conventional concrete house of the same size, ADHI House achieves considerable improvements across energy efficiency, embodied energy, and water efficiency materials. ADHI is able to make these significant improvements through its groundbreaking technology that harnesses the following environmental benefits. Minimized waste. Our wall frames, floor joists, and roof trusses arrive at the site pre-engineered and in kit, ready for assembly. This precision allows for no on-site cutting and virtually eliminates waste. Energy efficiency. The positive insulation characteristics of our light concrete and the air gap used for the building envelope allows for significant savings in energy consumption. Recyclability. The light steel frame used for the ADHI house structure is fully recyclable, and the formwork used for our foundations comes from 100% recycled plastic, lower materials quantities. Our lightweight concrete is six times lighter than traditional concrete. Our lightweight steel structure and the lighter foundations it requires all contribute to reduce the cost. You may be seated. Your Excellency, President Kagame, First Lady Jeanette Kagame, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, it is my absolute pleasure to invite you and welcome you to the unveiling of the Green Certified Affordable Buiza Riverside Homes. Mr. President, Madam First Lady, we are pleased you could join us today. I am Fatima Soleiman, board member of ADHI, and I will be your master of ceremony for the day. I would now like to invite Mr. Soleiman Abdi Eid, chairman and founder of ADHI, to deliver his remarks. Mr. Soleiman. I wish I have the capacity to, efficient, to be efficient and straight to the point that President Paul Kagame is known. <laughs> Once again, I would like to welcome you, all of you, our guest of honor, His Excellency Paul Kagame, President of the Republic for Rwanda, and First Lady Janet Kagame to the unveiling of the Green Certified and Affordable Visa Riverside Homes. I thank you for joining us. There is a lot of numbers you will hear, but an estimated 300 million new homes will be required by 2030. And this deficit is concentrated in Africa. At ADHG Rwanda, we believe that the only answer to tackle this global shortage is by building affordable, safe, and accessible housing that is environmentally friendly and built on sustainably developed land 
and infrastructure, and by locally skilled technicians using locally produced materials. At Adichi Rwanda, we are convinced that urbanization is more than just building houses, and that to support climate change adaptation, mitigation, and resilience, and the unifying housing to build, business as usual is not the answer. This will not achieve the sustainable development goals, nor the Paris Agreement targets. On the contrary, it will increase pollution and cause disasters, just to go back to China and India. The only alternative is to innovate, scale up, and access a smart and responsible investment. Mr. President, innovation. You are a friend of World Forum, Economic Forum, Schwab, is suggesting 3D printer. It sounds like Marie Antoinette when she suggested to the people rioting, to the people rioting to buy croissant if they don't find bread. We have homegrown African innovation. And the alternative to innovate and scale up and access smart, accessible investment, Adia to Rwanda, innovative and patented solution uses only 10% of the volume of construction material needed in the business as usual alternative, meaning traditional. It also produces only 2% of waste that's recyclable instead of the 25 in the normal construction industry. Our materials and construction methods are HC certified from 10 of this month. In a week, we will be waiting the lead report to certify our infrastructure. Quantified carbon footprints, traceable. My wife knows by memory the numbers of everything. With our in-house training, we offer skills development certification, and tools empowering both genders economically, sustained by the demand of quality homes in huge numbers and other construction, requiring less supervision, few errors in building and high quality homes without cracks. At ADG Rwanda, we are convinced that we can deliver simply because the government of Rwanda is ready and has in place all the tools and mechanisms necessary to make it happen. We see deeds, not words. We see partners, not spectators. We have received material and moral support, and we are dealing with the leadership keen to solve the low income population needs and concerns. Somebody says, Suleiman today is not complaining. The president will ask me what we are missing, what, what problem you have. I have one complaint, Mr. President. The people are shocked now. Who will be the target? No. It's a climate change and complain because if end of January and February, there's every day raining, I can present a better infrastructure. So if you can put in jail the climate change, I will be very pleased. I would like also to say, you will be visiting the model homes, but none of you here is neither our target customer, nor well equipped to make useful comments that we are interested. No, no, no. The people we need their advice are the, your drivers outside and the people with low income. <laughs> because you ask how many square meters, how many baths, what is the finishing? They ask you what house I can pay. Can I dream that house? So excuse me, you can visit, make your comment, but you know one thing, we are not arrogant, we are learning, and we will include every wise advice. The president is the champion, he gave us a lot of useful things. The other things I would like to say, we prove that affordable can be green, sustainable, and resilient. 
And the certificate of H is the proof. So I'm talking to DFIs. Reducing the cost of materials and eliminating the expatriate cost, everything we have done. But we need a smart financement. If you just allow, if the climate change pledges are not hoax and fake news, we are eligible because not only we are delivering what they requested in adaptation and mitigation, but we are delivering 11 out of the 17 sustainable goals. You know, today, my daughter from Wharton, she learned impact, social impact, environmental impact. If we impact the material, our project, no other project will be more eligible than the one project. So, all we're asking you is stakeholders of mortgage and stakeholders to wait. Four or five percent, which is double what my money, when I have a cash, I don't have anymore. Uh, was producing in four or five thirty years, Mr. President, the people will be equal to the rent in the Islamists. They will own properties. Hundred and fifty thousand persons can afford two bedrooms. And that is announced in the climate change new funding by General I know before the rich people was concerned, interested about climate change. Today they are scared. And they can come and say, don't have the peace that was at Welcome to AFR. You are part of the mission. Mr. President and the first lady, I thank you for all the encouragement. From the last time you came. Uh, technical and vocational education and training uh, in a wide range of economic sectors, uh, including the construction sector as well. And all we do is to equip uh, Rwandan youth with the right skills and competencies for them to be able to secure a job, uh, to be employed, or even self-employed. Uh, and uh, uh, this academy has the same philosophy and the same mission and the same objectives. I can see with the technology, it was light steel framing. Neo, I want to show you how to turn it into Viga. Baka, Bakiga. Uburjo, if you come, show you come. Show you how to use the machine. Do come. Bakiga. I'm a party. I just if you do my light steel. I'm your man. Why do you need practice? Baka, be there. Anya. Baka, be a garika. Baka, be a. The mission of this training center is to transfer the ADHI technology to Rwandans through empowering its trainees with the knowledge, skills and tools to become individual contractors and form SMEs in the building industry. Y technology rakora chane kuko irahendu tse kandi na gusawa wanu wenchi kuli ter kumu kovga rero na shikari zawa jenzi wanja wa kovga na wakui tinyuka kuko turashoboye kuko mwa bivonye dikora shodu kora shachane ni chingi chi kora shama visa na gobi goye y technology fite bini shitando kani ona technology sendi zisanzwe ichambe iri huta kuko inzuma shaka kui kora mudihe chukwe zikume. Muri tipe abantu batatu bane ni nk'inyungu imfite ngewe ku gitangiza ziharize ruta abandi bantu bari bose kuko uyu munsi uje ahandi uremerewe ni international hari hose uragenda ugakora cyo kiza cyane nacyo cyatumye twa interested cyane ku muntu yaza ku All our students, all those who will go through the training and be successfully uh, assessed, they will be considered for employment within the ADHI project, which they are putting up uh, affordable homes in Kigali 
using the light steel frame technology. Pleasure to now invite our guest of honor, His Excellency President Paul Kagame, to deliver his remarks. Hello, Mirwene Zamwese. I'm sure everyone understands what. Uh, I've just said, but uh, uh, Suleiman uh, and the distinguished ladies and gentlemen, I wanted to thank you and uh, ADHI and uh, thank the collaboration that has taken place between uh, you and ADHI and uh, our government institutions to demonstrate what is possible uh, in the area we have been uh, seeking to make some progress for a long time without making good progress. Um, when I met uh, Solomon a couple of years ago, um, he told me a lot of stories about uh, his technology and uh, in housing and how that can lead to achieving uh, affordable uh, housing for our population, especially the majority of them who need uh, to have access to housing but don't have high incomes, like uh, uh, some people are fortunate uh, to have. Uh, the other story is, uh, Suleiman confessed though to me uh, when he was talking and I was listening, he mentioned that uh, his wife always keeps him in a check because he talks too much. <laughs> so I consoled him, I said, talking too much is not a bad thing, as long as that much means something. If it is too much that means nothing, then that's a bad thing. But if you are talking a lot and uh, what you are saying makes sense, I think it's not a bad thing. So. In any case, I was raising that because having listened to him at that time, uh, all I had to do was uh, keep faith with him and say what he was saying made sense, but always the proof of the cooking is in the pudding. So I was saying, no, we need to see what you're talking about. And uh, that's how he set up this model to demonstrate to us what is possible. So from uh, talking too much, to keeping faith with uh, Suleiman, I think we have arrived at uh, having something standing by which we can judge that actually this is possible, that the problem we have had for a long time can be addressed. And this is just the beginning, there is a lot of work to do. Uh, as uh, he said, as uh, we all uh, have been listening to presentations made, there is a training of our people that uh, has to go into it. There are uh, materials uh, that have to be accessed. 
hopefully and mostly locally. And uh, the sustainability model of, of all this is sort of explanatory. Uh, and, and I don't think we can have it any better than this, to have it affordable, sustainable, and then uh, most of it uh, uh, arrived at through local materials, I think is uh, uh, the best combination we can have. So, Suleiman, what I wanted to mention, uh, with your family and uh, people you work with, uh, we, we, we are going to be good partners. We have been, but now even stronger partners we are going to be. And uh, if we can move faster, uh, that's our aim. We, we should be on the side of government. We feel we should do whatever is possible within our means. Uh, to have uh, our people access the kind of uh, affordable houses that are needed in uh, so large numbers. Uh, but now, today, we saw what is possible. We are going to stick with it, and we will demand that every one of us in the government system uh, does what we can possibly do uh, to make significant uh, progress. So as, as uh, then uh, you, you say, Daria, any time there is a problem, you know how to get to me. I'm available 24 hours. So uh, because I want us to succeed in this, and uh, I'm sure everyone here wants to and we have partners who want to support government to, to be able to house our people. And I think uh, they have seen uh, what is possible with this model. Uh, uh, I think it invites all of us for this strong partnership we can forge to be able to achieve what needs to be done. So. This is your home. This is a, a good partnership we have with the ADHI, and we have an obligation to make sure that it works. So, distinguished ladies and gentlemen who are here, and thank you for being here with us to see what uh, uh, Suleiman and the uh, DHI can offer. Uh, I'm looking forward to working with you uh, to make everything a success. Have a good evening. Your Excellency, Mr. President, thank you for your remarks. This marks the end of our program. Once again, Your Excellency, Madam First Lady, we are honored for the time spent with us tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, let us now rise as the President departs. We kindly ask everyone else to remain seated. bakomeje gukurikira ibiganiro bya televiziyo y'u Rwanda ngira ngo ho muhango wo gufungura cyangwa gutangiza ku mugaragaro ibakwa ry'inzu ze kiriritse hano ikarama ugeze ku musozo nkuko rero mu 
kuri w'igihugu yabisobanuye yagaragaje yuko akurikije uko bari kubakeza inzu bagaragaje nuko byanze bikunze berekanye yuko byose bishoboka cyane cyane bahereye ku bihari rero kuba hari ibikoresho byinshi cyane biri hano mu gihugu nabyo byaherweho kugira ngo bibashe kugira icyo bifasha mu kugira ngo ubwubatsi mw'inzu nk'izi ngizi bubashe gushoboka nabyo nindi ntambwe ikomeye kare none hagaragajwe ikorana buhanga mu byukuri rigaragara bityo akaba ariyo mpamvu afutanye bikorwa nkaba ngaba baba bakenewe mu byukuri rero hagaragajwe nanone yuko byanze bikunze hari abantu turagiye benshi cyane cyane umubare munini w'abantu bakeneye inzu zikiriritse mu bushobozi bwabo bitewe n'amafaranga winjiza ibyo rero umurongo umukuru w'igihugu atanze ko byanze bikunze abantu nkaba ngaba cyangwa afutanye bikorwa nkaba ngaba bafasha kugira ngo bakeneye inzu mu rwego rwabo cyangwa se mu bushobozi bwabo uko bwabo ngana kose nabo babashe kuzibona nabo bahawe ikaze mu gihugu kandi nkuko nakomeje kwibabwira hari mishinga myinshi yagiye igaragazwa yuko kubaka izinzu zibishoboka cyane cyane iyo turebye nka hitwa za rugarama muri nyamirambo iyo turebye za kinyenya iyo turebye hirya no hino zandera aho hose hagiye hari imishinga nayo ishobora kuzakorwa mu minsi iri imbere ikazubakwamo inzu zikiriritse bigafasha abaturage cyane cyane abari mu mujyi wa Kigali ugenda waguka umujyi ugenda uba munini mu byukuri unaturwa ku buryo ubugaragara byumvikana no yuko mu minsi iri imbere abaturage bashonje bahishiwe kuko nubundi inzu zijyanye n'ikerekezo zitangiza bidukikije zita akoresha ibikoresho bihambaye zikoresha nanone ibikoresho bya hano mu gihugu kuko abadukurikije amakuru dufite biravugwa yuko nibura 63 kwisha na by'ibikoresho bizaba byubatse izinzu bizaba biva hano mu Rwanda icyo rero nacyo ni ndi nyungu ikomeye kuberako mu rwego rw'ubukungu nabwo bizaba bifite byinshi bivuze kuberako yaba abacuruzi yaba nabandi bose kuruherekane urwego rwose rufite aho ruhuriye no n'ubwubatsi byanze bikunze bizagenda bifasha abaturage mu buryo bumwe cyangwa ubundi ikindi nanone umukuru w'igihugu yagarutseho n'ikijyanye no training cyangwa guha amahugurwa abantu hano imbere mu gihugu byumwe ariko muri rwego rw'ubwubatsi kubera ko nubundi ari byo bitenewe kugira ngo ba bantu bazaba bari muri uru rwego rw'ubwubatsi barimo aba bahabwa amahugurwa nabo bazongera inyuma bagaruke babonemo akazi hanyuma nubundi ya shene cyangwa se rwa ruherekane rwongere nubundi rufashe abaturage uko ayo mafaranga nubundi azabakomeza gufasha abaturage bahano imbere mu gihugu ni nyungu rero ikomeye ni nyungu yo kubona abafatanya bikorwa nkaba ngaba nkuko umukuru w'igihugu yabigaritseho agaragaza yuko bazakomeza kubafasha abasakomeza kubatera inkunga cyane cyane mu buryo ubwari bwo bwose kugira ngo ejo nejo ndi igifasha umuturage gituma umuturage atera imbere nubundi kizakomeze giterwe inkunga ubwo rero turategereje ko mu minsi iri imbere nkuko nahoze mbibabwira ko inzu magana 250 nebyiri zizaba zubatswe muri uyu mwaka nkuko kandi bakomeje kubisobanura abatechnicien nuko byanze bikunze nibura igihe abantu baba bari mu gufatanya mu buryo bwihuse inzu imwe ishobora kubakwa mu gihe kitarenze ukwezi yubatswe n'abantu babiri cyangwa batatu Ikero ni kigaragaza yuko byanze bikunze ubufatanye bw'inzego zitandukanye cyane cyane guvenoma y'u Rwanda ya kugira ngo ejo nejo bundi buri muturage mu bushobozi bwe abashe kubona inzu ijyanye n'igihe reka rero tubashimire tunakomeza kwararikira gukomeza gukurikirana gahunda za televiziyo y'u Rwanda ngiye na Jean Claude mutuye Yesu